Hi guys, the last poem we're gonna look at for the week is called a haiku. So before we get into the, make sure that you put your name and today's date, for me that's April 9th. Okay, um, a haiku, it looks like a very simple poem. They're one of the short, shortest poems you'll ever see, but they're a bit tricky to do. Um, a haiku only contains three lines, right? The first and third lines are five syllables long, and the middle line has seven syllables. So we talked a little bit about syllables when we were looking at limericks. The syllables are the sounds within a word, like kind of the beats within a word, I should say. So for example, the word haiku has haiku, two syllables, right? Um, the word attention has attention three syllables. So when uh, it has more than one of these beats within the words, uh, that's uh, um, each of the syllables, right? A, a word can have one syllable, like the word right, right, there's just that one beat, right? In our, uh, par or, sorry, in our haiku, we need to have a certain amount of syllables in each line. The first line has to have five, the second line has to have seven, and the third line has to have five. Now, for my example, you guys know I couldn't do a writing assignment without finding some way to put hockey in it at some point. My poem was called Canada's National Sport by Mr. Kimball. All right, so here's my poem. It's my favorite. Sticks, pucks, and nets are needed. Hockey is our game. Now, if you look at each of these lines, they all have the right amount of syllables. So the first line has to have five. It's my favorite, five. The second one has to have seven. Sticks, pucks, and nets are needed. Seven syllables. The last one, hockey is our game. Hockey is our game, five syllables. So you need to make sure that your, uh, your poem has the right amount of syllables. Sometimes it means you have to play around with it a little bit add words or take them away in order for it to fit into the, 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 uh, the scheme of it. Remember, when you write your poem, that you need to have a title. And please also make sure that your name goes with your title. All right, have fun guys. Thanks.